What is up guys? I'm gonna share with you 10 different tips for TweetBot 4. Number one, mark all DMs as read. Just go to your DM section and then double tap on the little mailbox icon to mark all messages as read. Super simple tip. Next up, quickly switch between themes. So use a two finger swipe up gesture or a two finger swipe down gesture to quickly switch between the light and dark themes in TweetBot 4. Customizable buttons at the bottom right hand corner two buttons on the bottom right hand corner. You can tap and hold those to customize those. You can switch between list, your profile, mute filters, favorites, search right there on the fly. It's a really great way to customize TweetBot 4. Next up, you have sharing shortcuts. Now, of course you can tap on a tweet and then tap the share button to invoke the share sheet, but you can also, watch this, tap and hold on a tweet and invoke the share sheet just like that. Next up, swipe to favorite or reply. Of course, you can tap on a tweet and then you can tap on the uh, favorite button or tap on the reply button if you want to, just like this, see, favorite, reply. Or you can swipe just a little bit like that to favorite or a little bit more to reply. Favorite, reply, favorite, reply, <laughs> there you go. Next up is switching accounts during message composition. So say you start typing a message and you just realize that you're typing it from the wrong account. So I'm gonna start typing a message here. Hello, what's up? But you know what? It's the wrong account. I meant to send it from iDownloadBlog's account. Well, super simple. Just tap on the little avatar and you can quickly switch the account without retyping the entire message. This can be a real time saver. Now TweetBot allows you to access your saved drafts by tapping the compose button, tapping the drafts button, and then selecting the draft you want to select, right? But what if you just want to compose a new tweet from the last draft you saved? Well, just tap and hold on the compose button. It'll automatically pull in the last draft just like that. Next up, quickly manage relationships. So if you tap on the avatar of a person and you tap the configure button, you can do things like unfollow, mute, etc. but you can also access that by just tapping and holding on the avatar, just like that, and access those settings in a quicker fashion. Now to rearrange account order, tap the account button in the upper left hand corner and then tap and hold and drag the accounts however you want them arranged. And lastly, you can switch accounts quickly by tapping and holding on the account button and dragging your finger to the account you wish to switch to. So that has been 10 different tips for TweetBot 4. Which one is your favorite? Let me know down in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.